Hello everybody, this is Wendy from Loving It on Keto and I'm at work this morning and I am going to make myself a bulletproof coffee. I have a keto collagen uh, vanilla <clears throat> here and I use about half, it's, it's pretty sweet and I use about half and do two cups so I get half in each cup. I've got a Columbia Green Mountain uh, Select Medium Roast Coffee that I did in the Keurig. I'm going to put just a splash of heavy whipping cream in there. I've got my trusty handy dandy little whipper to blend it with. And now for the taste test. Mmm. Oh, man, that is so good. Nothing like a great cup of coffee first thing in the morning. Anyway, I'm going to have two of these um, today because I only used half my collagen in one, and I'll put another half in my second cup of coffee. That should tide me over till lunch and I will show everybody what I'm eating for lunch today and if I have anything in between I'll show you that as well. So I hope everybody's having a great day so far. See you at lunch folks. Mm. Man that's good. So it is 9 15 and actually I was going to intermittent fast this morning and not break my fast until later today but I'm hungry. So I got two um, over medium eggs, which I chopped up, salt and peppered. I have two slices of bacon, and I have a cup of black coffee with a couple of drops of stevia in it. Stevia in it, and that's what I am having for my breakfast today here at work. Hey everybody, Harry here, husband of Wendy. Uh, I, today, I've been informed that I'm supposed to show you guys what I eat today. So, I don't know what I'm going to have. So I'm going to have to dig around a little bit and find out what I want to eat. You know, I really hate to do that. Because I never can figure out what's right and what's wrong. So anyways, I guess I'll give it a try. Let's see what I can do. Okay, so here's what I found so far. I found a chicken wing or leg. Some of the... Um, ground beef that we cook up, and an ounce of cheese. And what I'm going to put on here is I put a little bit of this mayonnaise on there, because you got to have your fat. And then I, I use this, this, this stuff, because it's really good for you. And you don't really taste it at all, but you know you need it for the, for the iodine. And uh, Cholula, because I like it hot. And then a little salt and pepper on there, too. That's the salt that Wendy's always talking about. Look at this. Can you see the size of those granules in there? Anyways. Here it is. Complete. Ready to eat. I'm hungry. Now that I made it. It's pretty simple. Took me three minutes. And I'm getting everything I need. Good for me. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. I think I'll have a bang with my lunch. This one, Star Blast. I think it's one of my favorites. I got a few, but boy, what a pick me up. Especially for somebody who doesn't drink caffeine, caffeinated coffee. Let's see what we're having for dinner. That's what I'm interested in. Okay, folks, it's time for lunch. I'm having some of this pimento spread. I'm going to have two tablespoons of it. And for two tablespoons, which is a serving, it's got three carbs total. And I'm gonna have my pork rinds with that. Then I've got um, some four ounces of ground chuck. I put two tablespoons of sour cream in it. I just put some pink Himalayan salt on it. And I love this new pepper. This is black peppers, white peppercorns, and green peppercorns, and it's absolutely delicious. So I put a generous helping of that. 
I've got my water over here and I am all ready to eat my lunch at my desk and then I'm going to go out for a little walk. So I'll talk to everybody tonight at dinner. So we are having our dinner and I am under the weather with this cold so I just grabbed a green giant steamer steamed the broccoli I grabbed from our Omaha Steaks Christmas present two of the fillets and one of the pork shoulder roast pieces and I put them in my air fryer and broiled them I put some Bad Byron's butt rub seasoning on them I have salt pepper I put a tablespoon of butter tablespoon of butter and this is two tablespoons of Daisy sour cream with a teaspoon of horseradish. And then I put salt, pepper, and some dulse, which is our iodine. It tastes delicious. It does not taste fishy or seaweedy at all. And it is delicious. You'll see me cooking with it quite often. And I think it's time to eat, folks. If you like what you see, Please like, subscribe, and ring that bell, folks. Give us a thumbs up. Good night.